Another day, another tent review. So the other day I put on my channel, I wanted to start doing a few more tent reviews. Uh, outdoor Gear Essentials, brand new shop approached me and they very kindly said, do I run a review the Lansham One? So I said, yes, please. I'll put a link to their shop below. I had a little look through their website. Um, looks like some really good bargains on there, to be honest. I know they make the ultralight sleeping mats themselves, but they've got quite a few nature hike tents on there. Um, they're selling the table from Novice Wild Camper, the YouTuber. The Lansham One, 2021 edition. This is 230 centimeters long inside, so it gives a bit of extra length. Really tiny package. In that you get the, the fly, the inner and pegs, but you don't get a pole. So you have to take your own trekking pole. Now, you can pick these up quite cheaply, about 15 pound a pair, only one you need really. Um, but they're good for helping you walk long distances. And then the weight of this, is super light because you don't have to take the poles then and the weight is this right let's try and pitch this up see what we get so here's the pegs this is from 3FUL they do make some nice stuff looks like it could be glow in the dark Attachments on the guy line, not sure. So it's got four points on there. Nice thick aluminium construction with a tiny bit of paracord on. And it looks like a little repair kit is in there as well. The inner is already attached to it. Makes it nice and easy the first time. I'm just trying to work out where the trekking pole will go. I think it's against this reinforced part on the inside. So I'll try and set this pole for 125. See what that gives us. 125 centimeters is sort of a standard. It's what most people walk with. It goes in there. I'll tell you what's confusing me now. We've got two different adjustments on this guy line. I've never seen that before. I'm not sure why there's um, a little clip on this. There we go. So that's my first time pitching that. That wasn't too hard at all, actually. I think with practice, you could put this up really quick. Get some shelter from, this, from the rain. Uh, so you're walking along with your poles, just stick your pole in there. Bosh, get in the dry. The material feels really nice. I think it's nylon. I'll put it up on the screen what material this is. The zip actually feels really thick. Reinforced. Let's see. Cut the velcros. You can roll open this door on both sides. Yeah, that's looking good. Ah, so it looks like. The door is on the right hand side, so really want to be opening the right hand door to get in and out. Let's just open them both up. So you can see the reinforced sections, that's where the inner is attached to, and also reinforced for the outer. Looks very sturdy actually.
And I've noticed with the bottom of the inner, there's this attachment. Yeah, so it looks like you use the same peg for the inner and the outer. But that paracord is so long, it keeps it quite a long way from the outer. Got three guy lines to peg in, and very annoyingly, I'm missing one peg. There's no feeling like getting into a new tent, is there? Come on. Well, I tell you what, you get quite a lot of space in you. Fairly easy to set up. And then, well, just spent a bit of time going around, making sure all the guy lines were right. But I think to get the basic shelter up, about five pegs, put the pole in, and then you're, you're there. Um, I would have liked to see this door go all the way across. So you could sit in the middle. But all around, it's looking really nice. Inside the tent, you can sit up nicely. Looks like quite a bit of room to lie down. I'll try that out now. All the corners are reinforced. Um, Pole doesn't feel like it's going to go anywhere. As you make sure you've got a tidy pole. This was only a cheap one, it was £15 for the pair. And it's solid. All mesh construction in here. So inside the tent, you've got that double skin, one tiny little pocket, maybe good for a mobile, that's about it. And it looks like we've got plenty of room to lie down, put my feet at the bottom. <laughs> you can see how much room i got above me there, that's crazy. I can fully stretch my arm out. So what I'd probably do is sleep a bit more in the middle of this thing. And then even if you've got a big mat, you're not going to rub your head against that then. Yeah, plenty of space. So there we go, the Lanshan 1 from 3FUL gear. One other thing I've noticed, it's got a tab on the top, so you could tie it to a tree above. If you didn't have this walking pole, that'd be another option. So I really like this. Pros, I'd say, I like the colour. It's nice and lightweight. It's reinforcing all the right sections. Um, fairly easy to set up and modify from the season, summer or winter, I could raise it up and down. Cons. I think it should have had an extra door this side. It would have made it way easier to get in and out, give you more options. And there's one peg missing, which is just a minor annoyance. Yeah, so that's it. I think this is going to be coming on some big adventures with me soon. Thanks again to Outdoor Gear Essentials. Check out their websites where they're selling these for £95. Check back soon when you can see me camping out in this thing. Catch you next time.